Okay, how is this fun? Like seriously, like how do you do this and actually enjoy this? I, I don't I don't get it. I want some rest. <laughs> All right, so there's an account on Twitter. If you guys been on Spurs Twitter at all, you've heard about this news, these sources, and it is, it's kind of gross, man. It's it, it's it's disgusting. I, I hate this type of stuff. Now, don't get me wrong. Like many, I said this many a times. Plenty of people can have actual sources, right? If I say something and I said that this is something that I'm hearing. It, it's from somewhere that I think is pretty reliable, right? Same thing with uh, Ty Yeager, same thing with other um, trusted, at least, you know, Spurs writers, Spurs people you can find on, on Twitter. They're, they're at least uh, reliable and, and they have a reason to be truthful or at the very least has a history of not just giving you any type of BS, right? Like there, there's plenty of people like that. But this account came out of nowhere it has uh, 40, well, it might have, might have more now, actually, but it had 40, follow, 210 followers now, okay? 210 followers, but it started at 40. Um, and what he posted was this. It was a couple things here. So obviously, when I read this, you're gonna say, well, Clan, of course you don't believe this because you're, you're biased towards Jeremy. Sure, whatever. But he says, apart from my reports earlier in the week, I am also hearing Jeremy Sohan is being shopped. More to come. I'm thinking the Spurs have come to a decision based on the chemistry between him and Wimby, having seen a connection between Sandro during Sohan's absence. Wow, that that's 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 brilliant. But the one that actually got traction is this one right here that has 167,000 uh, views, and it says league sources confirming Keldon Johnson and potentially one of Jeremy Sohan, Blake Wesley, or Malachi Branham. That's broad. Uh, will be involved in Spurs draft day trade, citing a large move towards building a championship contending roster around Wimby. More to come. So let me just say this, okay? Let me let me go ahead and say this, all right? This right here is something that basically any of us can predict. Everyone knows more than likely Keldon Johnson will be moved. Now saying Jeremy Sohan throwing him in there, I think that's more so just to stir the pot. But to say Sohan or Wesley, or Malachi, that, that, those are some huge jumps. These are three completely different types of players. It's not like the Spurs right now are trying to free up some more cap space. Or, like, th this is just a huge jump. It's just obvious that, okay, Sohan, that brings you a little bit of traction because Sohan and Wimby, that, that's been some uh, 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 controversy there it's amongst fans. Uh, Blake Wesley, hey, people don't really know that much about Blake Wesley, and more than likely Spurs are going to get a point guard pretty soon. So it's like, ah, oh, where does he fit? We know he's they're going to keep Trey Jones. And then Malachi Branham, the same thing, the exact same uh, situation where you're going to end up getting another point guard. Where does he fit? That that That's all this is. And, you know, you might be saying that I'm being uncharitable. Well, actually, there's a few things here, all right? So our boy, trusted boy on twitter here let's see his name is gz gz84 he actually did a reverse image search and found this exact same person this eric zhang or jang or I, i'm i think i'm saying it right saying i don't know it doesn't matter it's not the person's real name um this person uh actually used just some random stock photos and I did it myself as well, just for funsies. And yeah, you can see here, uh, Walmart used this same thing uh, when it pertains to wallet holder, badge holder wallet, uh, phone lanyards. They, they used it there. Uh, you can find them on Amazon. Um, he's very diverse, okay? This, this, this source here. Um, fashionable businessman suit. Uh, yeah, he, he's on World of Workers. He's on... PNG item. He's on salience health. Absolutely ridiculous, gross behavior that you just took some random photo that, you know, it's not difficult to find, but, you know, people wouldn't have just saw this, you know, just going about their day and tried to use it to say that you are um, a, a source trying to find yourself being professional. I think our boy here, uh, Mr. A, <laughs> said it perfectly he said friendly reminder is that time of the year when random accounts will put out information just to see what sticks don't believe everything you're seeing zero sources zero credibility just jokes and hope for interaction and that is absolutely true and this guy he responded he said i am the source just wait and see friend okay gotcha 
Um, but yeah, just wanted to show you guys that. Um, don't be fooled by it. I hate this type of stuff. But anyways, I'll give it to you guys later, man. Until next time. Bye, bye, bye. Bet US, America's favorite sports book and casino. Live betting and race book. We're celebrating 30 years with a historic offer. A 125% sign up bonus on your first three deposits. Plus 10% gambler's insurance. Get started today. Bet US, where the game begins.